Ever wondered how plants make sure they grow towards the light? No, you probably haven't. But since both light and water are essential for photosynthesis, there is little doubt that the plant has mechanisms in place to ensure its growth maximizes its uptake of these two key stimuli. Plants have developed responses called tropisms. Tropism is a growth in response to a stimulus, so light and water in the case of the plant. There are different types of tropisms. Positive tropisms are when growth is towards the stimulus, so the plant growing towards the light to maximize the stimulus for photosynthesis. Negative tropisms are when growth is away from the stimulus, so roots growing away from the light and deeper into the soil, so there is less chance of them being dried out. These are both phototropisms, growth in response to light. They are also geotropisms, which is growth in response to gravity. The stem undergoes negative geotropism, because it grows against gravity and upwards towards the light, whereas roots undergo positive geotropism, because they grow in the same direction as gravity, downwards. So unsurprisingly, plants grow in response to light and water, and grow towards or away from light, phototropism, and with or against gravity, geotropism. But something must control this growth. Just like humans, plants have growth hormones. We will look at these plant hormones in our video called Plant Hormones, Auxins and Gibberellins, and we will see how they are used in weed killers, fruit ripening and more.